All right, so with the release of Mac OS 13 Ventura is a new feature called Stage Manager. So I've had a chance to play with this over the last day and it's pretty awesome. There's some gotchas around it. I figured out how to get an extra stage on there instead of just having five, you can actually get six. I found a bug with AirDrop. So let's kind of dive into this. What Stage Manager's intent is, is to try to help Mac users stay focused, right? And get more done. Because when we look at our screens and they're completely cluttered like they are, overwhelming, right? And so they're trying to clear that up. So if we come up, let's enable Stage Manager. We're gonna come up here and we're gonna go down to Stage Manager and click Enable. Right now you're gonna see that I have these stages. I've got a Safari, a terminal, a different app that is new on the Mac OS, uh, the new system preferences, which is now system settings, and the notes app. So these are all my different, what I call stages, right? And if I want to, let's say I just wanna hide that stage, what I can do is just move this all the way off to the side and it goes away. When I drag it back, it comes back. If I open an app while this one is open, it will add it to this stage. If I click on the desktop here, you're going to see this go down and minimize to the Safari. You can see that I've got two different items here and I can choose either one right so I can just switch between them like that and they're different uh, stages almost within the stage I don't even know how to describe it really I'm like still trying to figure out what the heck to call these things alright so but the other things that I figured out is let's say I've got this one open and I want this terminal window to be open I can just drag it right on to it and now it's part of that little stage so now I've got a Safari and a terminal one I can click that and it'll open up if I don't want this to be a part of it I just drag it over to the stages area and it creates its own little mini stage off to the side um, one of the things that I wanted to bring up is if you have or you can see that I only have five. One, two, three, four, five. If I want a sixth one, what I need to do is I need to go into the dock and I need to change this. Yeah, I can keep it on the bottom. I can keep the dock on the bottom. If I do automatically hide and show the dock, you can see that now I have six. So I gained an extra one. You can actually get the same effect by unhiding it, or yeah, unhiding it and choosing left or right, right? So actually I do gotta, um, oh, this is buggy. I was noticing, hold on here. Oh, there you go. Now you see that it happened. It gave me the extra one so if I'm on the left or the right so now I can bring the dock back boom and I've got six if I move the dock over to the right side the same thing happens all right so one of the things that I wanted to point out was an actual bug within the stage manager so right now what I found is that if I want to airdrop this um, picture let's say and I do airdrop and I wait and I'm like what the heck nothing's happening um, <laughs> it's because stage manager is blocking it if I come back here and I turn off stage manager turn it off you're gonna see that the airdrop window is actually up and waiting for me to airdrop so 
you run into that issue, turn off Stage Manager for a minute and you should be good to go. If you haven't installed Mac OS 13 Ventura, then you definitely should go watch this video here, here, wherever it is and uh, get that thing installed on a separate partition. It's quick and easy and get to testing for us so we can figure out all these bugs and get them into Apple. All right, I'll see you all in the next video.